of that, MKLL definitely definitely hates for the most part. And he only busts out the Joker really for the Min Min. And now the reason for that is basically with Min Min, right? This entire time she's gonna be trying to play her game. She's trying to keep you out with her Dragon Arms as well. But with Joker, you have some really good scrapping tools to kind of get in close. You really like to play in that mid range as well. And you can definitely catch Min Min kind of committing in the front. And as you can see already, Bit is already kind of beginning the assault with Joker as well. We haven't seen too many instances of the gun, but that is one of the main resource tools you can do to kind of just stop the arms from getting thrown out. Once you get that one closed bullet, of power though, getting the upper hand right now. Bits trying to challenge the power of Persona, but can he get in with these same aerials on the shield? There's that Nair, put him into the corner, trying to snipe it out with the back air and power. Just trying to fight the Arsene off, trying to get back to the corner, but there's the dash attack. Trying to trap all around, a beautiful usage of the guns, and trying to get a reversal in this situation around. I do like that idea, however, it's just a little bit too committal for power on that part. It didn't work out. You definitely just want to get back to stage and play it out on safe. And you got to be careful when you're just trying to reverse the Joker and Edgar because he can get the one up on you. Yep, there you go. Dragon on to set onto the corner. The snipe to the jump as well. Power looking to push it forward and finally take that stock and put bits, spotting his pressure on in. Here's the grab. Grabbing him up, shaking him up just a little bit, but there's that down smash. A very fast move that Mimic can throw out. I believe that is frame eight. And it's a very solid move, move to cut out one of people when they're rolling on up. But there's the guns to lock in the shield and the cross up on the dash, or the down tilt rather. Gonna be evading to all of that as well, but hold up. Rare try and chew. Min Min confirms. Down tilt into up smash. You don't see that every day, but when you can get on close with the Min Min, you know, that's something you'll definitely see. But Vitz, right now, aren't with the Arsene. The back throw, the toss in the corner, trying to set up for this gun pressure as well. But I do like it as well. Ooh, a little bit of a, a mix up on the fair uh, there one into the, the back. I like that. I like that. And you can see Power is kind of struggling for this kill as well. He wants that down smash to kind of rock and just land off. And you can see him locking the shield. Vitz not opting to go for the throw in this situation. Maybe thinking that Power is going to launch an upstairs out of the shield when he goes for it, but you can see the fear. Power, I would be scared of Joker as well in this situation as well. And oh my god! Knowing that he wants to get the Dragon Arm laser, he goes for the counter, the charge as well. The Rebels guards have built up that meter for the Arsene, and things are kind of looking really scary for Power at the moment. I like the up air, send him up into the shield, calling out that jump as well, because with Joker, right? Against comeback mechanics, you can play so smart and defensive. Like, you cannot be scared at all, pretty much. You have to play with no confidence. That's what they fear the most. And they're like, why are they not? Why are they approaching me? Why are they doing this thing? They should be fearing me. I got the big old comeback mechanic. But we're down to an even game right now. Power kind of not getting the grab that they want. And Bits going for the back here, trying to get the F tilt for the DI on him. see this time around power is trying to push bits into the corner being the aggressive one this time around you can see that they are playing a lot more safe out of sight of joker's range but when joker chases you off the gun there's no jump and there you go there and on out that's gonna be game one in your favor always gotta be careful for these resources with the downward guns right you can't really put yourself in the position to be kind of reversal like that you have to say like x about distance off the stage so Kind of just jump on in, so you jump on back, so you can kind of get your ledge trap going. Because Joker is a pretty powerful ledge trapper. When you've got that nice reaction time, he does have very solid options all around as well. But we're going to game two here, probably running it back to PlayStation Two, one of the best songs, Rocket as well. Zinnia's theme. Shout out to uh, Omega Ruby and Alva Sapphire. All right, the parry on the down air, not quite parrying the second hit as well, and some utilization of the down air as well. The down guns trying to put in the work of a min min, and as you can see before, not what he was he was trying to show us this time around. He had it unlocked this time around, so he definitely proving me wrong out here. But oh my god, that was a beautiful empty hop to get the throw to put him into the corner, but it's the min min game this time around. Do do have Arsen for the flight, forcing that higher approach. Power kind of had the stock right there in this instance, but if they just kept the stage, that would have been them. Would have been G's. But you're still very much in control of the situation. There's the jump to snipe it on off. There was, honestly, 
but um, Vitz really didn't have to fear kind of dying unless they launched a Dragon Laser because they had the Chakra. They didn't have the Megaton Watt. If they landed that Megaton Watt, it would have been G, but reading the DI, getting that F Smash on in, and getting some solid hits with the gun as well. You already have the lead as well in this case. You just got to close it on out. There's that back throw the center of the corner, though, setting up for this ledge trapping that Joker is definitely capable of doing. Yeah, power retreating from the sides of the stage, trying to set up their zone and on game. But Vitz just invading that space with the back air, setting up for the ledge trap as well, trying to get a bit of a Rebels Guard in for some of that little bit of, a little bit of our set engage. The downward gun call out, all right, kind of like it. Build that little chip damage. You have 152 on the board. Arsene is near in the corner. You don't have anything to fear right now. Just the guns trying to get a little bit of more chip damage on the board. You can see power kind of fear right now with all these rolls. They can just run to the other side of the stage, but they're just opting to roll on out. And there's the side beam still putting in that work as well. Downward gun, trying to get a little bit of damage before they come off the stage. But what Vince needs is just he needs to get in with one kind of throw, one kind of move, and that's it. There you go. Back throw in the corner. Not quite going to do it, actually. Power hanging on with 199. But the up air finally popping off that top. And now Vince with a pretty convincing lead right now. But it is Min Min. They can get one solid back throw, one solid kind of ledge trap going with the Megaton Y. And ooh, the suspect, the eye. Like, ooh, I'm predicting the future out here because we're back to an even game. This is danger time for Vitz. Arsene Gage is though coming around the corner. Power is setting up shop. They do have the percent lead right now. There's a dash attack that sends into the corner. You gotta play a really smart, good call out with the chalk and the neutral air as well. And beautiful patience in the shield as well. Now you link to these Joker back, there's no percent either. And Vitz just trying to read it on out, trying to get that down there. And what? Power makes it back to the stage. And what they need to do right now is they need to stall out the Arsene. If they can stall out the Arsene, this is basically their game. They can't let him get himself get ledge trapped. And there's one of those downsides. He finally launch it, and there's the snipe jump, and that's going to be it. Power clutching it out 2-0. Oh, I mean, that, that was such a clutch up from Power. Vince basically was in control of the game the entire time, but one little slip up. You let one little inter neutral interaction kind of just rock like that against Min Min, and you're suddenly like in the worst disadvantage you ever see. Especially when you got the suspect the eye too. It's like, you can't be sleeping on this character. She's nasty for a reason. There's a reason why Leo fears this character.